Steelhead trout will be collected later today as they enter Avonia Beach. The Pennsylvania Fish and Boat Commission will be collecting eggs to artificially fertilize in hopes of growing the fish population. Samir Nefsi joins us now live from the Fairview State Fish Hatchery with more on the collection. Good morning, Samir. Yeah, hi, good morning, Dave. That's right. We are now inside one of the pools. We're here with Craig uh, Lucas right now, who's the hatchery manager here in Fairview. Now, we are inside the pool. We have some more uh, steelhead in here, so we're going to walk through the spawning process of that now. Correct. Yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, today, we'll be collecting more adults to do these spawns with. Typically, spread this out over eight spawns, eight collections. Uh, later today, once it gets daylight, we'll be out doing some collections for these fish. Uh, we'll currently walk you through a quick spawn, uh, see what we got here. Props to Craig for being able to stay that focused with a bunch of steelheads over here around him right now. Okay, so they're sedated right now. Yeah, so we have these knocked out. This is a female. So typically what we do is we'll spray the eggs into a colander so it drains off all the ovarian fluid. Okay. Drop the fish back in. Then we grab a male. All right. So at how many eggs do you think you guys got out of that? That fish there will probably have about 2,500 eggs in it. Okay. So then the male, get some of the milk from it. It's all mixed together on the eggs. Swirl it around. And we'll hold that. Let that water hardened to take these eggs back to the Tynesta hatchery. We'll hatch these guys out here probably about 35 days. Uh -huh. uh, within a year, hopefully we end up with stuff the like these guys. End result right there. These guys will be stocked out at the end of February through March and April. Uh, makes for a great fishery up here. Right, right. So for someone at home who's wondering uh, why this is important, explain that to them. Uh, we augment this fishery up here. These fish are very important to economic development of the area. Uh, without our input into the system, there wouldn't be much of a fishery here. So we help the, the fishery out greatly by stocking nearly a million smolts every year. Also offer up the co-ops another 100,000 for them to grow out. Uh, then every year we get this return back to our nursery waters and just the cycle continues. And then uh, this is a pretty good year to go steelhead fishing as well. Yeah, it's been a pretty decent year this year, so uh, pretty happy about it and lots of fish out there to be had. Definitely pretty cool. Thank you, Craig, for joining us this morning. And uh, we're going to stick around here and hang out with the fish for a little bit more, but I'll send it back to you guys in studio. All right, thanks, Samir, for showing us something a lot of people may have never seen before. Quite interesting.